Gemini, all placements, Chinese your horse, made of a beautiful air. Welcome to the Vibe Tribe family, the biggest little family in the world. It's your empathetic sexual therapist with an adult reading. I have done two adult readings today for Pisces and Virgos. If you guys are, um, are dealing with Pisces or a Virgo, I recommend to go watch them. If not, I already did a Gemini reading as well, but you guys needed an adult reading because Spirit said it is what it is. So, we have Let's Do 69 in the back of my Lincoln with the Suicide Doors by T-Pain song coming through for you guys. Okay, you could like to do 69. And your thighs are juicy and thick. The better it is for the, that clit, clit and dick. Okay? Your juicy thighs makes it better for the clit and the dick. Okay? <coughs> we have the Death card in the Reversal, the Three of Pentacles, and the World. Okay, with these signs, Scorpio twice, Capricorn, Aquarius, Leo, and Taurus energies. Chinese year snake, Chinese year pig, Chinese year ox, Chinese year monkey, and Chinese year tiger. Okay, we are in the Chinese year tiger right now, by the way. This is a timeless message, so whenever you come across it, it can be for you. Happy holidays to all of you too, by the way. I do appreciate you guys just being a part of this Vibe Tribe family. And I want you guys to know that my extension of happiness for all holidays goes to all of you. Okay, so just so you guys are not alone ever in anything. Okay, with the death and the reverse, that means there was resistance, right? The inability to see the truth, the inability to see the outcome, the inability. So some kind of fear was holding somebody back here in the sense, maybe sexually, okay? I do see somebody making a full turnaround with this fear that they were holding. They have now t found the strength to push themselves through these fears. Facing the death as it really is. Facing the real truth as it may be. And accepting the truth as it is, is what I'm getting with the full death card. I'm just looking for a detail. Somebody could like long socks. So, you know, when the feminine wears those long socks that go all the way up into their thighs. And it's just super sexy and a turn on from the masculine's energy. And they could really want that during the 69. Some of you guys have maybe lost somebody in your life as of recently. And you guys are definitely going through the grieving stages. My condolences to any of you who have lost anybody at this time. Whether it would have been an actual family blood member, a family friend member, you know, or even just somebody you had actually known that had lost somebody themselves and you just feel that energy. Maybe you knew them a little bit here or there, whatever may be something about loss and, you know, sadness with that. There has been teamwork collaboration with the Three of Pentacles and I can see that the masculine has a huge turn on for the feminine they can't even control themselves right when they get home from work it's almost like oh dinner's made i want your dinner what's between your legs give me them give me some of that milky you know titty type of thing going on really the feminine may really like their their nipples played with or their boobs played with or licked but i feel like the masculine really enjoys doing that in the first place so I do see the feminine is very hardworking in the sense of really good at cooking, really good at cleaning, really ma like maintaining a lot of different good things at li like in life. Maybe just kind of um, like all around jack of trades feminine energy is what I'm getting. Masculine's really good at like their job. I do feel good energies for the masculine in their future there is definitely promotions there's definitely salary increases and or um uh, some kind of bonus or something like that is what i'm seeing <coughs> but you guys have the world here right so a, a blonde hair is significant and black hair those are the two hair colors that are significant here um the feminine's got thick juicy thighs and that's something about something exactly about that that is perfect for the masculine and such a turn on i don't know if they're going to be able to keep their mouth shut next time you guys are getting it on okay i get this feeling that they're just really engulfed with passion right now the world also is kind of symbolizing to me that there is a huge reflection that both of you you and your sexual connected partner have reflected on yourselves 
and this is what's bringing you into this brand new world and opportunities that are just going to be presenting to presenting themselves left and right for all of you okay a certain base could be significant maybe like your grandmother or somebody in the past had a vase or somebody does still have a vase in their house that's kind of like i want to be able to show it to you uh, like same pattern blue and white <clears throat> That was what's picked. That's what's sticking out to me right now, specifically with this. Okay, pink is specific too, by the way. Somebody really could like pink. All right, let's see what we want to say for the rest of this for Gemini's energy. As I do that, the magicians on the bottom. <laughs> you guys are manifesting something, but my throat today is my own fault. <coughs> so, I'm sorry. My throat just got all itchy right there. Interesting. Interesting. How does this work? Okay. Okay. Devil's on the bottom in the reverse, so it makes sense. I'm going to tell you the two cards that fell through. Because I was a little confused. And then I got, you know what? I got this sign, and it was like, yo, there was a karmic here. There's a definite angry karmic. Holy moly. They're mad. That's why I didn't I didn't understand it for a second. I was like, nobody's angry over here. There's, there's two harmonized people, like, you know, really pretty good relationship. And then there's this angry um, SOB on the side, I'm going to say. This person could be older. Or this person could... Let's see, let me, I'm getting this weird, uh, so this person acts like they're young, or they just really are ir irresponsible as hell, and they're old, but they act old, like their mentality when they were with, because they're an ex, okay, they're either your ex, Gemini, or they're your partner's ex, a sexual connected partner's ex, this person acted old, and didn't want to do anything when they were with this person, whether it was you or your partner. But now they're all like, I'm wild and free, crazy, blah, blah, blah. I'd be doing all this wicked stuff, wicked and crazy stuff. I'm not feeling good vibes from this person. And I've felt this before for you guys already. So not too long ago, actually. <laughs> yeah, this is a karmic, though. That's why the temperance is in the reversal. And the king of wands is in the reversal. Very right? tyranty energy. It's so annoying. And I'm only like getting drained because of it. So I get it can drain you guys sometimes. But there's a new world you're entering and they want you to know that's where you claimed your power back with the devil being in the reversal over here. This is the toxic energy that you're like, hey, I don't need that. So you are moving into something better. Okay. That could have been where the resistance was too. Uh, but there's been a lot of reflection on both you and the sexual connected partner that you have that this person hasn't done all that. So they're falling behind already as we talk, as we're speaking, they continue to keep falling behind. So... That's Sagittarius or opposite sign. It was a challenge for you if you were with this person. Or it was a very challenging energy for your partner, okay? You also have uh, Leo and Cancer's energy. And it already has been put to an end. The world over here with being Leo. And that lean Leo, that has put to an end for this brand new world to begin, right? So this is all ending for this person for good. Um, Cancer is Chinese, your sheep. This person's all up in their emotions as well. <clears throat> okay? And Capricorn's energy opposing that. Yeah, this was super challenging. Let's see what else you want to say. And there's the Ace of Pentacles wanting to come for you guys. It's a brand new beginning. Lots of vulnerability. Lots of sex. Okay? Lots of sex. I can't even begin to tell you that that's not going to be denied for your future, for your partner. And you both will not be denying each other sex or pleasure. <clears throat> Black hair again, significant. Blonde hair again, significant. Brown hair too, maybe slightly dark. It's just really dark hair. Very beautiful smiles you guys have too, by the way. The feminine has got a perfect body. The feminine may be on a weight, weight, uh, like a loss goal or something like that, where they're trying to lose some weight or they're trying to build some muscle or something like that. I do see them actually fulfilling that. By Christmas, they're going to see big results on the scale of what they've been wanting to achieve or just in the mirror of what they've been wanting to, you know, work on their body part, whatever certain part I'm getting, their hips, and I'm getting their, their like shoulders, like on the back right here. So their shoulders into their hips, like that's the one part I've, I feel the feminine is really trying to work on the most at this time, doing certain exercises to make those look better or tighter or fitter or whatever it may be. 
that they want, the, the, the literal, you know, outcome that they are looking for and wanting to achieve for the feminine's energy is the, there's an ability to have that happen by Christmas. But it's not like they're not beautiful. Like the masculine sees them as very beautiful any any way they look. Maybe the feminine has a hard time believing that. Now in this past relationship, there was a third party situation. It could have been definitely kept under under the counter, under the secret, like it was a secret, very secret. So you guys have new beginnings coming in. This person's just a very angry person that you've already taken uh, all your power back and uh, claimed that, you know, you're done with all that craziness. So let's catch you one of these. No, marriage could be a partic participant in your future. Okay, but somebody had made a promise to themselves and now it's finally being broken in the act of pure and true love. Like I promise to never, you know, let myself be open or vulnerable again because of past relationships, but that's ending because of love, right? And someone, all, all someone ever needed was acceptance, recognition, and support. A deeper meaning to the feelings being let out, kindred lovers and spirits, eternal, established, and infinite shared bond between two like-minded and sold individuals the hidden matters of the heart chakra blocked by throat chakras cancellations so yeah you guys are you know finally allowing yourselves to accept this relationship into the new world that you are going and releasing the past for final good for the benefit of your future for the benefit of your partner for the benefit of what is to come okay and that's a really big energy to keep i love this reading actually we do have highest level, manifest high level of unity consciousness, demonstrate acts of love, kindness, and humility. The state of waking consciousness, deep sleep, and dreaming every human being with a functional nervous system is capable of doing all of these things. Okay, a huge transformation happening in your life. Grandmother energy is protecting this connection. Someone loves to watch movies, romantic movies, horror movies, thriller, documentary, history, fantasy, sci-fi, comedy, entertainment, something like that. But you guys could be watching a movie and having a sexual night with those movies. Okay. Sounds fun. Sounds like a great time. You guys are working on a really beautiful relationship. It's harmonizing. It's beautiful. It's flourishing. People are angry. It is what it is. You're leaving them behind. It's almost like they'll never be in your energy again because you just are gonna be in such a new part of yourself you know you don't even recognize these energies anymore you won't <laughs> it's gonna be like in the next 15 years wait who are you oh like you'd really have to think for a minute before you know what i mean if you don't really talk to this person you're from your past or you don't see this person you don't have any children connecting you or anything like that you would have no clue in the next 15 years who this person would even be they would have no clue how to even interact with you if they saw you in public you know what i'm saying that's the feeling i'm getting it's totally you're changing for the way better for your own good and that's that's what your high your highest level manifestations of consciousness are and i hope you guys enjoyed it i'll see you guys next time please like comment or subscribe and happy happy holidays